So far, we've discussed a couple of different ways to describe the central tendency of something, or the average. But there's a third way that also sometimes makes sense. For example, if we look again at the weights of those NFL running backs and offensive tackles of the Kansas City Chiefs football team, when put in order, we found that the mean is 261.8 pounds and the median is 275.5 pounds. And as we pointed out earlier, neither of those really reflect a typical or average player here, as there isn't a single running back or offensive tackle anywhere between 245 and 305 pounds. Hmm. However, this is a perfect situation for another measure of an average, or perhaps said better, typical player. And it's really simple to calculate. It's called the mode. Definition. The mode is the number that occurs most frequently. For instance, in the data set above, if we look for a weight that occurs the most often, we actually find two such possibilities. Every single weight occurs only once, except for the weight of 220 pounds, which occurs twice, and the weight of 320 pounds, which also occurs twice. And so there's actually a tie for the number that occurs most frequently. 220 and 320. And so we'd say there are two modes for this data, 220 pounds and also 320 pounds. In some situations, there will only be one value that occurs more than all the others, in which case there would only be a single mode. But in this case, there was a tie between two numbers, and that's just fine. In fact, it's more than fine. Because if we look at the numbers of 220 and 320, we can see that actually this is probably a much, much better representative of a typical weight than the mean of 261 or the median of 275.5. The running backs are being represented by the mode of 220, and the offensive tackles are being represented by the mode of 320. Sure, those modes are both on the high end of each of those groups, but they are still much more typical than what the mean or the median gave us.